hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel scripture everything here again with another cool video for you today uh, today we are going to be doing an update on the sweet test net okay so previously i made a video on my channel talking about the sweet airdrop okay so the difference between this and uh, and the previous um, video that i made is this was on devnet and new one right now is majorly on testnet so the difference is um with devnet uh whatever you did periodically would be cleared out so for every transaction that you did on the sui network on the devnet was would be uh periodically cleared out so all the transactions would just be as if you did nothing so even if you were interacting with the application months ago you would have to uh, be as if you would never did at all so but now they are on testnet and now it's better so we can actually do it and we are actually very early to this right now guys so we should do this okay so as you can see on twitter as you can see there are going to be two um two waves okay so the first wave is going to be uh between two to three weeks as you can see and then there's going to be a second wave so we are in the first wave right now and many people will, uh won't you know know about this and we are pretty early so make sure you do this and on you might hear from developers on you know people saying on twitter or the developers telling you there will be no airdrop for testnet users the reason being that uh they do not want you to be a crypto hunter they want you to genuinely you know they want to be a part of this group so that doesn't mean that it's not going to be an airdrop for testnet users definitely for a project as big as this it's going to be uh there's going to be an uh an incentive a reward for early users and early users are early testers and those testers are also make sure you not give up okay so try everything here right now i'm gonna leave everything here i'm gonna we're gonna do everything step by step okay so uh make sure you follow my every move and um, but before we move continue um if you are new to my channel please do subscribe to my youtube channel and so that uh, you get notified anytime i make a new video make sure you turn on the notification bell icon and give the video a like uh, it helps us reach other people and you know, as a contribution to the channel thank you in advance and let's jump right into the video so there's going to be a list here for us to do the first thing we want to do is um go to chrome store and download this um you download your wallet okay so i already have my rig here so i'm using the sui wallet you can see use the sui so all of them they are you know they kind of hold your sui so i'm already gonna head to download my wallet so the next thing we want to do is um uh switch from the devnet to the testnet okay so if previously we were using the dev devnet so what you have to do when you come to your wallet is click over here okay and click right here and move from sweet devnet to sweet testnet okay this is very important because uh with if you use the wrong network you are going to you know not have the results that you are looking for so the next thing you want to do is claim which is the number three we want to place some claim some free tokens okay so once you come to your wallet so sorry mine is to load in so as you can see it just came out request some test sui okay so all right so as you can see i got some free sui um test tokens so the next thing i want to do is uh move on to number five okay so if you click on number five it's going to bring you right here so initially there's going to be a connect button all we want to do is um mean some nft so we're just going to create some nft we can just call it uh let's say ctr okay and then we'll put in a description and if you want to we'll just put anything you want and then an image url so you can go to google to get an image url or you can just use this image url this image url right here uh, for simplicity and then just put it in there and then just click on create okay then you have to approve it in your wallet and then if it's successful it's going to show up here Okay, it's a, as you can see, uh, NFT is successfully created. Let's check our wallet to see uh, if we actually did get anything. So just move to the NFT section, as you can see. Okay, so these are the two NFTs that we have created using this link. So we are going to continue from there and move on to the next step, which is step six. We have to get our um, wizard NFT. So if you click on that link, it's going to bring you here. All you have to do is connect your wallet. So you choose with wallet. We're using the SUI and then just click on Mint Wizard. Okay. And then approve it. Okay. So once that is done, uh, congratulations, you have minted this NFT. Let's quickly check our wallet to see what it looks like. Okay. So move to the NFT section. So you can see wizard land. Now we have done five and six. Let's quickly try number seven. So right now, the number seven, uh, I think, is kind of, um, you know. So just click on that. Uh, I think it has an issue, and uh, so it might not work properly for you, but uh, it might. Okay, so uh, let's just see how it goes for you.
okay so once you come over here um, the first thing you need to do is connect your wallet okay so um this is a, like a, a breeding ground okay so where you get to you know match some nfts to make even more so uh i'm supposed to be able to uh, get some you know you know means i get this free cap keyboard uh let's see if it works so uh let's quickly approve this so I, I don't know what is wrong with this okay so you're supposed to be able to breed some of the copies okay so if you have two you just breed them as you can see if you click on this it said you need at least two for breeding but when i go to my copies to you know mint and then get some of the free copies it just doesn't work so i think uh, you know if you find your way around this here you could let me know okay so but i have been struggling with this uh you know it's testnet so let's hope that it they will rectify that in a minute okay so after you have you know played around with that you can move to the next one which is the 2048 game okay so uh so if you click on that it's going to um, bring you over here to this place so what you do here is uh just play a game it's a tile game okay so uh what you have to do basically is use your your keyboard arrows okay on your desktop on your laptop to you know match tiles together uh numbers from you know larger numbers and then you can you know the larger the numbers that you have the more you you tend to win let me scroll down a bit so you get to see what i'm doing um you know just try to match it you know i'm using my keyboard arrows you know the four keep four arrows on my keyboard to try to you know make the tiles you know match so you just have to figure it out to you know the more tiles you 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 get to fit together the the more as you can see uh, so i've got up to 32 now so that is what you do and once you have done that you, if you have gotten to um, level 64 i don't know any level you get to the higher level the the better obviously so i'm just going to as you can see so match 64 so i'm not gonna play anymore I'm just gonna continue with the video then once you have done that then you can just click on beans okay so the reason i is not showing up like this is because i've already minted this nft so if i get to a higher level then maybe i can mint okay so there's gonna be a mint button here and then it's gonna mint it it's gonna be like an nft in your wallet okay so let me just quickly uh let's play it up to that stage okay so as you can see i got up to 128 so all i have to do now is click on claim click on claim is going to mint as an nft in your wallet okay so uh we can quickly check our wallet to see if it's there if it's minted yeah let's see okay so i just go to the nft sections and see okay so as you can see it's already minted as an nft here so the more games you play uh the more you know advanced you go the better for you okay so make sure you interact with that and the next thing we want to do is go to um keepsake.gg okay so i used this in my previous video what you do here is um you know create nft collections you have to connect your wallet um so you're going to use your sui wallet so you just come over here upload it picture or whatever you want okay just upload it and just give it a name if you want to and then just click on create nft okay so we're gonna create nfts uh, this is a collection okay and you just have to upload it uh, so once your collection is approved um you just go to go to create okay so you can create an nft so we've created a, con a collection so you can create an nft now and then you lease the nft for sale so basically um just uh, play around with the whole thing this is not new it's not easy to navigate so all of the links here i will leave them in the description below so make sure you do interact with this um if you have any issues here you can let me know in the comment section below uh it's pretty much easy all of the links like i said will be in the description below and I hope you found this video helpful guys so do not miss uh, all these airdrops okay because so is gonna be a massive one so at every chance that we get is going to we have to make best use of it and like i said it's gonna actually run for just two weeks okay so uh two weeks okay so make sure you do check out this video and i will see you on the next one guys bye